Hello guys and welcome to today's video, hope you guys are doing good. Today what I have for you is the brand new Plants vs Zombies Battle for Neighborville update. We got some news on the PVZBF and Trackle Trello, I will leave the link to the site in the description down below. Uh, we got some couple of news on what we actually will get uh, tomorrow, since tomorrow 29th of September we're getting a brand new update. It should be live at like 6, 7, 7, 15 p.m. UK time. Uh, at least we think so. Uh, it doesn't necessarily mean it will be that time, but that's like usually when the updates uh, are launched. But we'll see when this actually will be a thing. Well, we got some a couple of uh, things that we got that uh, will be in the updates. I'm just gonna run you guys through this. Obviously, bug fixes and patch notes will be still still will be the thing. Uh, as I said, the update will be launched on 29th of September, which is tomorrow. So tomorrow we're gonna have uh, some uh, new uh, new updates and all that stuff. Obviously, as you guys probably know, TV head and Bonfall will be back tomorrow, since that was the that was already we already knew that because it was it was saying late of the September on that Twitter post that we did a while ago. Uh, the only thing is, how much will they cost? I think they will cost like uh, 500k each, so in total 1 million coins, like the wizard. It just makes sense for those two characters to cost to pay with coins and not with rainbow stars. I think coins will be a better shout and uh, it will be, I guess, just better in general. And it will just make sense, I guess, but we'll see about that. Uh, another thing that we got is uh, Chomper, the rate of fire glitch. It's actually being fixed, but only in PvP side, in PvE sort of st stuff, it's not been fixed yet. So that's some updates on that. Now, some of the bit of an interesting thing that we have here, the second to last thing that we actually have here is the Battle Arena matchmaking. It will be way easier to get Battle Arena matches, which is kind of good, purely because uh, Battle Arena seems like really fun mode to play in general, uh, and especially it will force, especially on PC, it took like takes like two hours to find a game or something like that in Battle Arena. So I guess that will be a bit easier to find now, which is quite a nice nice change and I really think Ballerina will be now playable for any, any players who even play BFN anymore but if they do Ballerina will be an option for them as well and the last thing includes uh, PS4 players or not just PS4 but PS uh, PlayStation users and Xbox users uh, we have a bit of an update on private play the private play will now and uh, will not require the PlayStation Plus or that Xbox uh, Gold, which is quite good because a lot of people will, will uh, were arguing that they should not have PS Plus or Xbox to play private play. So that's now good for you, PlayStation and Xbox users, because you can now play private play whenever you want. And that's pretty much about the all updates that we have. Um, nothing else added here. I said the link of this site will be in the description down below. And this will be probably one of the last Bell for Neighborhood videos that we'll probably ever do. I think I'm gonna just do uh, two more videos on uh, TV Head and Wildflower Zombies to showcase them once they are fully released. Maybe some patch notes were released with them as well. We're gonna do those two videos and maybe we'll do like a documentary of BFN. That was, I was thinking about that, but we'll see if we're gonna do that. But yeah, this has been a really short video because they're just we're just covering updates at this point. So yeah, we're gonna cover that. And as I said, two more videos on BFN, maybe even three, we'll see. Wildflower, TV Head Zombie Showcase, and then uh, that's the end of B, uh, BFM. We're gonna say farewell to the game. We may come back sometimes, sometimes in future to see what the state is of the game. Maybe we'll still have some players, maybe we'll not have some players, we'll see. But yeah, guys, that's gonna be it for this video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure to leave a like on it, subscribe if you're not here, and let me know in the comment section what you think of this subject. I think this subject is actually being pretty good. For the last, I think the, they did a great job of balancing some stuff in the... As I said, uh, Battle Arena has been fixed a bit, which is quite good. And I think they did a pretty sol a solid job with this last update. So yeah, let me know in the comment section what you guys think. Thank you so much for watching. Take care and uh, peace.